a smaller, more honest soul. It's true that a simple spark can ignite hope, breathe fire into the hearts of the weary. The ability to derive strength from hope is undoubtedly mankind's greatest attribute, which is why I will focus all of my power to snuff it out. I'm Samantha Ducker and I'm a technical sergeant in the United States Air Force. So I work in the public affairs career field, but what that means specifically is I'm a communicator. We get to communicate messages for Secretary of the Air Force, um, Secretary Wilson. So I spend a lot of my time researching what she is saying and understanding the background of what she means when she says it and really understanding it and then trying to communicate it. My days and weeks are very busy. They're very busy. Um, but I like that. I like the grind work. I like the meetings and having to do things. That's just my personality. Um, so first and foremost, I need to get my workout in. So I wake up at 3.30 in the morning on the dot, actually 3.25 to be exact. That's how much five minutes means to me. Um, so I hit the gym for about an hour and a half to make sure I get some good running in. I have a shoot at nine. I'm gonna do homework in between my shoots, um, somehow fit in lunch, and then another shoot, and then more shooting, <laughs> and then my day will be done. It's gonna be a busy day, but I got done working out early, so I'm gonna do some homework, and I'm gonna answer some comments on my YouTube channel. So just trying to make use of any minute I have right now before the day gets crazier. So on YouTube, it's gonna sound kind of weird to someone who's not into this type of thing, but I, uh, I do reaction shows. So what I do is offer my very raw reaction to shows that I watch first time. Go, Baku, go! Yes! Oh my God! Soldier boy comes marching oh my God. home. and then I give my feedback and overview of what I'm thinking about the show. I have never felt so much emotion, so much anxiety, so much on the edge of my seat, what is going to happen. So cosplay, um, I'm not sure what it stands for. Costume play. Costume play, there you go. So costume play, the way I see it is just really, um, kind of creating a costume um, of a certain character, but adding maybe your spin on the character as well. So sometimes it can be very direct and on the nose, like exactly what that character dresses up like, or cosplay could be how you take um, that character and kind of get to play a role for the day. So it's not just dressing up though, it's really embodying that person. So when I played a villain in Austin or I cosplayed a villain in Austin, I very much felt like Villainy. Not that I treated anyone like that, but I felt um, I felt like the character. Having a hobby in YouTube isn't just for my personal life. These things that I do, I can bring back lessons learned over to my section in the Air Force. So while the Air Force and my YouTube page are not trying to target usually the same audiences, I can take away what um, the platform is used for, what kind of demographic is on that platform, and then bring those back to um, my section to let them know how that platform can be leveraged for what we're trying to communicate. 